If you guys have this problem in your Nintendo Switch, this video is for you. And in this video, I will teach you how to solve this problem. So hello guys, my name is Avor. In today's videos, I'm going to teach you guys on how to solve that dreaded Nintendo eShop problem that you guys may have, especially if you guys has, have just purchased this Nintendo Switch and you guys may encounter this problem. Well, this error code, as you guys can see, is the error code 261309988. So what is the problem? Well, the problem is because your Nintendo Switch is from a country where the eShop does not exist in the country and therefore there is a problem. Well, there is a workaround on how to solve this problem and I'm going to teach you guys on how to do it. The very first step you guys are going to do is basically just hop over to your computer or phone and go to accounts.nintendo.com. So I'm going to switch my screen. See you guys then. So guys, once you guys are at the nintendoaccount.com, link is down in the description below if you guys are interested. But once you guys are in this website, you guys will be able to see your whole Nintendo info, your date of birth and all this information. Well, in this video, we'll basically teach you guys on how to get your eShop working in every country or whatever region that Nintendo does does not support so yeah the second step you guys are going to do is basically press the edit button on the profile and once you guys have press the edit button you guys are basically going to change your country or region of residence so i am going to switch over to the united states which is the us because currently Nintendo does support the US and not Singapore which is a country that I'm currently residing in so that is kind of a big problem that Nintendo has to fix because for some reason I feel like the Southeast Asian countries are not being supported by the Nintendo eShop so once you guys have selected United States as a country of residence, you guys are going to press the save changes button. And once you guys have done this, you guys are going to agree and you guys are going to wait patiently. Voila, you guys have changed your country to the United States. Once you guys have changed your country to you, the United States, you guys are basically going to launch your eShop again. So as you guys can see, I am going to launch my eShop again. And this time, it will prompt me to sign in. As you guys can see, sign to your Nintendo account again. So you guys are going to press OK. And once you guys have pressed OK, it should prompt you to input your password. So I'm going to um, blank out this screen because I do not want you guys to hack my account. So I'll catch you guys in a bit. So as you guys can see, I have just entered my password. So I'm going to wait patiently. As you guys can see, the Nintendo eShop should work right now and there we go as you guys can see i'm able to access the nintendo eShop once i've switched over to the united states of america as you guys can see the eShop it, it is working as you guys can see for my account and i will be making a new video on how to get cheaper games by changing your eShop and yeah i'll hope to see you guys in that video that future video as well but regardless as you guys can see I have um, the ability to be view and buy games but do note that the games that you guys um, are going to buy at is the United States price so do bear that in mind but as you guys can see the Nintendo Switch has been configured and the eShop is able to run so i hope you guys enjoyed today's video i hope you guys give this video a thumbs up and i'll see you in the next video